Alright, so my sermon in title is Do You Love, Obey, or Cleave Unto Jesus? And so we will be starting at, um, we will be starting in Deuteronomy, Deuteronomy 30. Gotta find it really quickly, sorry. Uh, Deuteronomy 30, 20. Okay, so it starts, uh, the verse says, and it says, and it says, that thou mayest love the Lord thy God, and that thou mayest obey his voice, and that thou mayest cleave unto him of thy, um, uh, for he is thy life. So, first of all, I would like for you guys to turn to, um, Psalm 18. So, Psalm 18 is where I want you to go. So, if you can, if you have your Bible, turn to there. Psalm 18. All right, it says in verse 1, I will love, <clears throat> I will love thee, O Lord, my strength. So, um, who wrote this passage here was David, of course. David is a prime example of loving God, and we can just learn a lot from him and what he did for Jesus. And so, my first point would obviously be that thou mayest love the Lord. David did that a ton. And so, yeah. So now, my second point would be that thou mayest obey his voice. And this would be in First Samuel 3, if you can turn there. And it says in verse 1, And the child Samuel ministered unto the Lord before Eli. And, and the word of the Lord was precious in those days. There was no open visions. So, pretty much, this is talking about obeying his voice, and Samuel did that very well. He's another prime example of obeying Jesus and loving him because he just did all of that stuff, and he obeyed Jesus when he said. Of course, he had, he was also very, he had very good, great courage because, um, he told Eli that his sons were just wicked, and he confronted him about it because Jesus told him to. And so that my second point, of course, again, is that thou mayest obey his voice, and now, next place is going to be in Daniel, first, or I mean, just Daniel 6, Daniel 6, and so it says in verse 16 and 17, or just 16 actually, it says, then the king commanded, and they brought Daniel, and cast him into the lion's den. Now the king spake un and said unto da Daniel, thy God whom thou servest continually, he will deliver thee. Now, my third point is that thou mayest cleave unto him. And Daniel did that when he was in Lion's Den. And he just did it all of his life. He was a very faithful man. And we can just learn a lot from these three people. They did a lot. Daniel loved God a lot. Uh, Samuel got, uh, obeyed God's voice. And Daniel, of course, cleaved unto Jesus, or God, when he was in the Lion's Den. We can just learn about a lot from these. Uh, you can just learn how to love, obey, and listen to Jesus and cleave unto him as well. I feel like that we just need to do this more because if we don't, then we're going to become more far away from Jesus Christ and that's not what you want. You want to be uh, closer to him. That conclude my sermon concludes with just follow these men and read your Bible as well. And I hope you learn something from this message. And I hope you have a great day. And see you on the next video.